Hello, and welcome to another episode of Reality Rip. In today's episode, we will take an in-depth look into one of the most mind-blowing phenomena in quantum mechanics, quantum tunneling. Quantum tunneling is a quantum mechanical phenomenon where a particle can pass through a potential energy barrier that it would not have the energy to cross under classical mechanics. This is as if you threw a ball toward a wall and instead of it bouncing back, it appeared on the other side. But how does this happen? Let's first take a look at the world of the very small, the quantum world. In the quantum world, particles such as electrons do not behave like solid balls with definite positions and speeds, but rather like waves that spread out over a range of possible positions. This wave called a probability wave describes the likelihood of the particle being found in different places. So when a particle encounters a barrier, the wave doesn't just stop at the barrier. Instead, it diminishes rapidly but continues to pass the barrier. This means there's a non-zero chance that the particle could be found on the other side of the barrier. And voila! The particle has tunneled through. Quantum tunneling isn't just a curious phenomenon with no practical use. It's actually at the heart of many technologies we use today. For instance, tunneling is a crucial component in scanning tunneling microscopes, which allow us to image surfaces at the atomic level. It's also used in certain types of computer memory and even in some types of atomic clocks. Moreover, it's thought to play a role in nuclear fusion in the sun and other stars, where protons need to overcome a huge energy barrier to collide and produce helium, releasing light and heat. In a classical universe, the sun wouldn't shine. It's thanks to quantum tunneling that it does. But quantum tunneling still poses a lot of unanswered questions. One of the most puzzling is the so-called tunneling time problem. How long does it take for a particle to tunnel through a barrier? Does it happen instantaneously or does it take a finite time? Answering these questions could help us understand more about the nature of time itself, which remains one of the biggest mysteries in physics. Despite the challenges the and unanswered questions, scientists are exploring the uses of quantum tunneling for future technologies. One exciting possibility is quantum computing, where quantum tunneling could be used to perform computational tasks more efficiently than classical computers. Another more speculative application is the concept of quantum tunneling communication, where information could potentially be transmitted faster than the speed of light by exploiting quantum tunneling. However, this idea is still very much theoretical and controversial. As we delve deeper into quantum tunneling, we might ask, could we use this principle to teleport matter? Well, in theory, yes, but in practice, it's a little more complex. Large objects contain an astronomical number of particles, each with their own wave function, all intricately entangled with each other in a wave function of mind-boggling complexity. The probability that all the particles in a large object would simultaneously tunnel to a new location is so incredibly tiny that, for all practical purposes, it will never happen. Additionally, maintaining the coherence of such a large system 
without it being disturbed and collapsing due to decoherence is currently beyond our technological capabilities. But who knows, in the realm of quantum mechanics, nothing is truly impossible. The prospect of using quantum tunneling for teleportation, however distant, remains one of the most exciting potentials of the strange phenomenon. Quantum tunneling is also believed to occur in nature, not just in high-tech laboratories. Some biologists believe that enzymes, which speed up chemical reactions in living organisms, might utilize quantum tunneling to enable reactions to proceed at lower temperatures than would otherwise be possible. These are just some of the intriguing ways quantum tunneling could be utilized in the future, but for now they remain largely theoretical. Quantum tunneling may be a common co occurrence at the quantum level, but it continues to elude our understanding when we try to scale it up to our everyday world. And we've come to the end of another mind-bending journey into the quantum world. If you enjoyed this deep dive into quantum tunneling and want to learn more about the weird and wonderful world of quantum mechanics, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Until our next reality rip, stay curious and keep exploring.